Crypto gaming and crypto games have been one of the most innovative applications of cryptocurrency since the 2017 launch of, for example, CryptoKitties, which actually allowed crypto gamers to actually play to earn. And since then, a lot of different play to earn games have developed with the use of NFT technology, for example. And right now you even have play to earn games on iOS and Android. So that's what we'll talk about. And let's get started with the topic. First, a quick disclaimer, I'm not a financial advisor. All right, now let's get right started with this video. I do want to say that all the games we will talk about, all the projects we will, we will talk about in this video, links to their websites via which you can also uh, find download links for the App Store and the Google Play Store will be down in the description. All right, so if at any point of time you see a game and you think, hey, I want to play that, then you can just check out the description for those links. But now onto the, the video. So the first project we'll talk about is a League of Kingdoms. Now, this is a personal favorite. League of Kingdoms is one of the most developed games in crypto right now. Also has a very big token and you can play this on Google Play and the App Store. All right. So what the game is about is basically it's an MMO strategy game. All right. It's basically strategy between different kingdoms which you control or you control your own kingdom, of course. And you can also trade digital assets. You have different NFTs within this game and then you basically through cooperation and through conquest you have to expand your realm all right so you can fight with your own kingdom and with your own armies you can join an alliance or start your own kingdoms and alliances and you can elect your leader so you actually have different on-chain voting it uses blockchain in that way to elect leaders within the game now in the game, you basically have three different blockchain features, which will also all be accessible on the App Store and the Google Play Store. You have land, all right? So that's what you have to claim. This is in NFTs. Then you also have your own dragon or a drago, on the, which it is called on League of Kingdoms, uh, which you can actually adopt to earn passive income with DST tokens. And you have Loka, that was the token I talked about in the beginning of this video, uh, which is the governance token, which you can actually use uh, to have some governance about the game. So this is definitely a game I would recommend you to check out. Like I said, if you want to check it out, the links will be down in the description. Now, the second game we will talk about, which you can also very easily play on, on your mobile devices, is called Splinterlands. Splinterlands is a card game where you actually have a lot of different things you can do within that card game. And they actually also allow you to earn quite a lot of money. It's, it's a big play to earn game, all right? So this is very basically what it looks like. And each battle has a different combination of combat rules, total mana cap and playable elements. So that creates a, a lot of difference between games and therefore it also not easily becomes boring. Now within the game you have a lot of different cards as well which is great to actually have that great gameplay. Now you have four different rarities, seven different stats which can be changed, seven elements, over 64 abilities and over 500 cards right now. So very big card game. I think it's one of the biggest ones in the entire crypto space. Uh, so there is a lot of variety and you will not get bored easily. Now, right now they've already awarded over $7 million in tournament prizes. It's, it's one of the biggest play to earn games, like I said, and they actually have some backing by some huge partners in crypto. But apart from that, also really specifically to the gaming crypto space. So if you, uh, you, you'd like to check out Splinterlands, then like I said, all of the links will be down in the description. Now the next project we'll talk about is called Realm, R-E-A-L-M, but again, links will be down in the description. So this is another NFT game, which you, can also use, which you can also download via the App Store and the Google Play Store. So basically what the game is, and that is important that you that you actually know that, is, is a resource management game, all right? Where you st strategically utilize your NFT leaders to save the world from devastation. So you basically have a world map there's also on their website, there's there's a gameplay trailer, which you can actually check out. And you have to collect resources, unlock regions, build up your in-game RLM tokens to level up your realm and much, much more, which you can do. So you have different leaders, 11 unique leaders. You can do different upgrades to those leaders and you can also blend them together. And altogether, you can earn RLM tokens while doing all of this. So here on their website, you can actually find their NFTs as well. So you can see right here, you have different leaders, so the economist, the cyborg, but then you also have the salary rate boost, the re reputation boost, the recorder, which is equipment. So there's a lot of different NFTs, which enrich the gameplay of Realm and which make it actually a, a fun game to play. And they have a lot of different uh, seasons so far and different pack sales. So if you're interested in that, check that out. And here on the, on, at the very top of the website, you can click play Realm if you want to play that. And the last game which we'll talk about, which is actually an amazing game as well, is called Meta Apes, all right? So again, links will be down in the description. Here at top right, you can download it on the App Store 
or the Google Play Store. And by the way, on their website, you can also see a little bit of in-game graphics. I think it looks amazing, but I think the game is even better, all right? Because you have to choose to be a part of an elite pack of monkeys. You can choose six different clans. You have to protect and lead convoys of precious resources to power up your rocket. And while doing that, you fight other monkeys from other clans in, in massive PvP. And you can also make friends with other players from your specific gang, all right? So it's not only strategy, it's also exploration within the world. And there's a lot to it, all right? Big NFT collection behind it as well. Have their own ape chain, have their own blockchain network, which is great. That shows that it's, it's a serious project and it has some serious development as well. So personally, there are guides on how to get started as well via the blockchain very, very easily via their website. Personally, we definitely recommend you to check that out. But that is the last game we'll talk about for this video. So if you found this video helpful, please make sure to add a like and add comments with questions I might have missed and subscribe to our channel.